Countdown. What's good? Oh, wait, yeah, you move the camera. I'm over here looking over your shoulder for the camera. Oh, yeah. He always trying to do stuff. You always out here trying to do stuff. Always say, yeah, yeah. He ain't that way. Shot. Yeah, we got to get the other way. All right. That way. Yeah. Um, <laughs> we from the north. We from the, from the super north. <laughs> One that time way. for the north side. Let me turn that down. What's up, y'all? What's going on, y'all? You're truly DJ Nats here checking in. I'm going to start off with the quiet storm voice today because that's the kind of mood I'm in. You know, when the rain and, and, and the cold starts to hit you and you start to feel it in your knees, shout out to anybody over 40. You understand what I'm saying? You've played ball for more than five years. You understand what I'm saying? So that's the kind of voice, that kind of mode we in right now, man. But we're here. Either way, Pause for Applause Podcast. Here to bring you another week of entertainment, edutainment, and every other E involved in the alphabet. Alongside my part in crime, the one and only. It's well, man. It's well a thrill. Professional shit talk extraordinaire. Love of the people, the culture, and everything about it. Here. There it is. What up, now? What up, G? Court's here. Yes. I'm going to keep doing that till you come up with a drop. I know. I told I, you, but I'm here. I told you, you here. shit. Present. I told you shit. Yeah, yeah here you go. <laughs> it's just a super drop. Checking in. <laughs> Good to see y'all fellas, man. Glad everybody, everybody made it here safe and sound because, um, you know, there's a lot of things going on outside. You know, a lot, a lot of tomahawks in the street. You never know what weapon going to come oh, in. We'll try to form against you. Um, <laughs> Cricket, what's good, G? Um, Will, catch us up, man, on what you didn't do this week. <laughs> How uneventful was your weekend, Will? Yeah, that's a new segment on the show. Fuck, man. <laughs> Dragging my shit through the mud, nigga. Kane, what up, G? My Long shit be entertaining no to me. You in the hot seat early. I mean, you know, if you ain't got anything to say, you ain't got anything to say. I just want to think about it. You know, I got to go back. My memory kind of uh, did a lot of uh, a lot of what? pharmaceuticals as a youngster. Oh, okay. Took a lot of aspirin. I got it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's, all. that's what I meant. Chanel, what up? That was, that's what I was going with. Okay. Um, what did I do this fucking weekend? <laughs> Besides curse. Oh, that shit is deadly. Um, <laughs> what up, Trey? <laughs> Family's out there. I ain't do nothing. So, oh, all right. I did something yesterday. So, yesterday, no, nah, I ain't, ain't had my children this weekend. So, I, it was uneventful. No, that's a lie. No, you know, no, no, it's the truth. I didn't. Um, oh, ah, shit. There you yes. Go. I got it. It came to me. It's Halloween weekend just passed. Right. <laughs> I swear it's Halloween weekend. So, I don't really do the Halloween thing getting dressed up unless I'm unless I'm going somewhere and I did not go anywhere. It's Halloween. So, what I did do is um, we was in a house and I happened to be, like, taking the kids somewhere to get. I was getting gas coming back from picking them up. I was like, oh, that church is having a uh, little trunk or treat thing. Mm -hmm. So you know me. Free candy. Right. That's, the sign might as well just say free candy. <laughs> <laughs> I'm in. Right. Rochelle, what so up? I, I turned the block. My kids are like, we don't need costumes? Costumes. <laughs> what? You don't see us? Walk in doing a thriller, man. Struggling black folks. That's, <laughs> that's, that's what y'all went at? Nah, I'm just went. <laughs> <laughs> so, um, so we go. We do the little trunk or treat thing. Oh, it's weird to me, like going to like trunk or treats at churches, and they got like demonic like stuff. I'll be like, this is kinda, I've never been to a church like that, brother. It's kind of trunk with skulls in it. Yeah, I was like, <laughs> the vampire costume with the blood hanging off your mouth. No, that, it's supposed to be the fall festival at Jesus, the churches, man. Jesus loves you. Trick or treat. Right. Like, wait, that wait, what, that's a good question. What kind of church was it? I have no idea. It wasn't. <laughs> it was. Uh, it was pretty light. Can I say that? <laughs> it was. It was light. Okay. It wasn't very dark there. I mean, but I know where you live at, so. And I ain't talking about the time of day. <laughs> you did? And you yeah. still felt comfortable. <laughs> yeah, huh? I mean, hey, bro, we was, it was outside. I was like, yeah, we want to, it was on a corner, very visible. Yeah. Said, oh, we got some stuff inside. I was like, I won't find out. <laughs> <laughs> we made one round around the parking lot. I think I'm good. Where'd he go? Sir, come back, we're having a pancakes bre pancake breakfast. Right. Oh, thanks to the flyer. Mm -hmm. Wow. Bought your LP. I'll break weed up on it. Thanks for the flyer. All right. Okay. But nah, so we did that. That was uh, that was cool. They had some pretty good candy, respectfully. Well done. That's one of right. your better stories. Yeah, so we went to that. <laughs> so then, then, you know, I get a break. Then, um, like on Wednesday, I went to go get the kids. Yeah. Um, And we did a um, we did a, a, a car pick, a carnic. I just invented that term, like, just now. Okay. So what is that is? It's a car picnic. So what I do is I got a I got an SUV. So I put all the seats down. Mm -hmm. I set up like the a laptop or the computer in, in the car. Like I lay all the seats down. Mm. Put it up as like a like a like a movie theater screen. We lay down all three of us lay down. That's dope. Eat snacks and watch a movie. Look at the fatherhood tip. And hey, you're welcome. On, you're man. welcome, fathers. You're welcome, America. Hey, that shit was, that shit was free. I mean, other than the cost of the food. You got that off TikTok? 
I didn't, yo. Okay. <laughs> my, my, no, no, that, my, imagine, my imagination is crazy vivid when That's it comes to shit like that. Because when you said... Shout out to Laura Chesson. She when, you said, <laughs> when you said Karnick, you know, my mind immediately went to Freaknik and thought you was going to do something along those lines. I said my children, bro. Not, no, make, before not that, making though, children. No, before that, though... How you God, do. that didn't happen at Freak Nick. Um, <laughs> that you know of. Yeah, no, I am well of. Anyway. He's got a 30 year old kid running around here. Anyway. Anytime you 30. can entertain kids without electronics, yeah. you definitely you're not, you're going somewhere. I've got a 25 year old kid running around. No, nah, no, nah, let's go with what Courtney's talking about. <laughs> <laughs> Arson Crafts, yeah. Hey, Dad. <laughs> <laughs> Who is this nigga? <laughs> no, nah, you're right. Anytime you can get, you, nah, you can yeah, entertain you kids up, without that, it, it's, it's definitely up, a bonus. It's had definitely com- had that conversation, man. Just they, they be they be mad at me because I'd be definitely be that dad. They'd be like, no, we put the put the electronics away. Yeah. We're about to talk. Yeah. They be looking at me crazy when Take I say now we, we eating at the table. They be like, what? No, they don't understand. <laughs> what are we gonna watch? Oh, they don't understand, bro. <laughs> what are we gonna watch? Nothing. Molly, what up? Yo, what nothing. What are you talking about? <laughs> there's, there's nothing to watch. It's us. <laughs> yeah, we're right. just gonna talk. This is all you get. They be looking at me like the lamest motherfucker of all time. Like this. <laughs> <laughs> like you're insane, like yo, he's losing it. That conversation losing it. again. Right. Oh. Everything's a lecture. You want to know how my life's going? Oh my god, again. <laughs> yeah, I, I love him. Oh man, I know. What but you that mean. was my week, though. That, that uh, was you did some following. Yeah, I worked. What you mean? <laughs> how was it? Working was great. Um, great vibes, of BQE. That was some good energy over there. I actually got dressed up in my one go-to co- uh, costume that ain't hard to put together. Uh-huh. Hip hop guy from the nineties. That's it. <laughs> ah. So they like, yo, you run DMC, um, yeah, Rakim, all of that. Spe- all of that. Yeah, all you know those. The, the the gold chains I I invested in years ago get get, quanti- get uh, plenty of burn over the years. You know what I'm saying? That's a good move, bro. Yeah, you know what I'm saying. So that's the best part about it, yo. So Jay was like good, it. brother. Um, Court, so that was that, and uh, oh no, oh, oh Molly, yeah, Saturday, Saturday night, I went and checked in on the fam at um, at uh, where was that? Theory Lounge, Theory Lounge, my man, uh, shout out DJ Rock a lot, yeah, yeah, and it, it was it, it was DJ rocking. Marathon, yo, it was a, it was rocking up there, it it was, that had yeah. that shit going on, so Ooh. happy birthday again, you know, Scorpio yeah. family, uh, happy birthday Tone and uh, Polo, so we we going back out there again. Right. What's the best costume you seen this weekend? <laughs> hmm, Holly Berry. What is her costume, sir? Yeah, the Cat one, woman. the strictly business one. Mm-hmm. Somebody really did that. You was there. Why do you keep doing that? Yo, theory, what? theory, theory. Holly, the Holly Berry costume, denim jacket, the blue jeans, white shirt, I short thought, haircut. That's I thought the Holly Berry did. costume. Oh, that's the Holly Berry costume. You sure that was a costume? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> she like, yo, she she might have like just been pulling that off. That's right, like, just been pulling the look off. That's yeah, like Saturday fit. Oh yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah. You, you know like something? That. Right. You might be right. Oh, you know what I'm saying? She was dope though. Yeah. And when I saw it, my old mind, I was like, I was thinking like, oh, I seen that movie. <laughs> but my, my That's what came to mind. Yeah, dead ass. Okay, no. that's not what I was thinking, but uh, <laughs> we'll go with that. He said, "The Lord is my shepherd." <laughs> right. He know what I want. Yeah. <laughs> Court factuals. Court, you was a ninja, correct? Yeah, of course. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> What's that? Mentally. In my mind. Yeah, yes. Yeah. Most definitely. <laughs> But now, my weekend was lit for the most part. Oh, yeah? Oh, damn. Okay. Damn, bro. That's my only off day, so I'll be finding that. Hey, listen, I, I'm doing it's something. Lit. Yeah, yeah listen, I'm it's doing up. something. So, right. It's going in. But I went out to um to the Braves Stadium Sunday. Oh, you did? Nah, what was that? What was that? So they won Monday, game right? Game six? Game, that was Tuesday. Tuesday, that's correct. Yeah. My bad. Um, yeah, I went out there Sunday. It was loaded. You yeah. Couldn't, you couldn't sure. even get to the park. Like, yeah. You know, you know, when you go inside the battery, the park's like towards the back. Yeah. yeah. And when you, yeah. I, like when you had to get out the Uber at? Like, I didn't even get out the Uber. I really wilded out and, and went down there with my car. Oh, where did you yeah, park? Biggest mistake. That's, why, was, that's, that's why I didn't go out there sun, uh, Tuesday. <laughs> I'm about to say, where did you? Where would you? Where did you park at? I got bro? a little. I got a spot out there. Don't tell. Don't, don't, don't say that. No, no, don't yeah. do that. Don't say that. Don't do that. Nah, it's, it's totally legal, but everybody don't know about it. I don't give but it no, away. that's why we saying. Yeah. Don't yeah. say that. Yeah, they tell me later, but don't tell me later. I found parking. Went out there. The energy was crazy, you know. But they was losing that night, so you kind of. You kind of felt that, you know. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> right. It, it got to a point where it was kind of just like, yo, we just out here for the bobs. That's it. <laughs> yeah, Atlanta knows it well. I'm just here so I don't get fun. Yeah, listen, I, that would so, have been shot. So let's, let's lead it to our first question. All right, let's go. Where were you? Is the curse? Has the Atlanta curse been lifted? First now? of all, let's say a little right. That's just the wrong way to start. Congratulations to Atlanta slash Cobb Braves. Woo! First championship. You know what I'm saying? Let's go. No, I'm sorry, man. Five I'm minutes. Oh, my God. <laughs> no, you're about to do something. I know. You're a baseball nah. fan. Not 25. I am a baseball fan. Um, you know, nowadays, you got to have a membership. Yeah. <laughs> it's ridiculous. 
We trying to stay positive right now. Yeah, yeah most definitely. Let's go, Braves. After 25 years, man. 25 Joe, how you feeling? Years. Amazing, man. Yeah. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. <laughs> the city got one. The hey, city man. got one. <laughs> now we could go with your question because I wanted to get that off of me because, you know, people are like, yo, you just a hater. I'm like, why am I no, hating I on the team? No. Yes, you know, I'm, I, I'm legit happy. Yeah. This, was the, this was the one time I was actually rooting for the Braves. Well, I wouldn't go that far. No, yeah. yeah. my <laughs> hatred for the Astros runs pretty deep. Why? They, they cheated the Yankees out of a championship. Yeah, they did. Yeah. So fuck them. So go Braves. Oh, all right. All right. Yeah. Yeah, Other than go. that, <laughs> I don't give a shit about the Braves. I'm being honest. But, I, I mean, yeah. I'm happy that they won them. The city of Atlanta deserves something. Yeah, yeah, man. So now, the real question. Besides strip clubs and COVID. <laughs> <laughs> so the real question. <laughs> Wait a minute. Where's the drop? Hey, listen, man. <laughs> you guys, trying you to got transition nothing to frenzy. You don't even know. Guys, you need to lay down. I'm over here saying, like, why? That's all. My fault. Got the AK today. I forgot chicken wings. <laughs> Jeez. Shout out to Lemon Pepper Lou. Oh, man. <laughs> I'm going to let you finish. Nah, you don't done, listen. <laughs> this is why I said let me congratulate the Braves now. Oh, this guy, man. This yeah, guy yeah. over here, man, I actually uh, like living here. I don't man, know about you. I love Atlanta, man. I ain't gonna lie. I'll never move anywhere else. Oh, never? Uh, well, eh. yeah, I take it back. Okay, thank you. Like, there's plenty of places on this table. I Well, anyway. No major city in America that would move uh, more, more than Atlanta. Yeah, I can't say that anymore. I like Atlanta. I do too, but, you know, I've been here 27,000 years. So, you know, yeah. grown, grown child, you know what I mean? Go ahead with your uh, with your with the with the with the direction you were going in. Yeah, sir. yeah. Fuck my life and what I'm yeah, trying to figure like, out. Over nobody, here. nobody's here for that. <laughs> nobody got time for that. <laughs> Is the curse broken? Is the sports curse now officially broken? If UGA wins, then yeah. Why is the World Series not enough? All right, let's put it like this. Let's put <laughs> it like this. Okay, go ahead. Yeah. I think it's lifted. To be honest, I, mm. th- I would say, I would say, I was just being funny with the UGA thing, but I hope they win. But I think it's lifted, man, because since 1995, yeah. that's a lot of L's, boy. <laughs> Yo, Super fast. it's 2021, man, so it's, yeah. it's definitely. I mean, the, cur- the curse wasn't just the, you know, I don't want to say just the, it but it was the, the way city, yeah. they yeah. was losing. But, you know, the you soccer know? team won 2018. Yeah, it's football. So, Braves following up. So, if you, I guess you could say no, it's, it's the only football lifted. championship you're going to see. I'm sorry, go ahead. Shit. <laughs> Through the alley on that one, boy, from half court. Oh, my gosh. You might have bounced that one. Jeez. Nah, I love, yeah, I, shout out to the Braves, though, man. What do you say, Will? Super good luck. Uh, hell no. It ain't, nah, just, <laughs> nah, they got one, man. Like I said, I, I'm actually happy for them because I love the city of Atlanta. So, I mean, salute to them. I'm happy for them. Oh, man. I'm happy. They're, they're not as a, a – and a, as far as Atlanta teams go, the Braves fan is the least yeah. obnoxious of the fans. Yeah, the least. Are. The Atlanta, the Falcon fan is super obnoxious. Okay, you talk about fan wise. Yeah, okay. the, the fucking right. Hawks fan all of a sudden is yeah, obnoxious. I've seen some Braves fans be honest with themselves. Yeah, I ain't yeah, seen a Falcons mean, fan yet. No. Excuse my language. <laughs> yeah. Falcons and honesty is not a thing. It could be, though. <laughs> right. It could be, though. I it's mean, not, it's all right, man. It's hey, hey I, I admire the fact that you like, I mean, they people who love a squad that much. But I just be looking at my team like, yeah, how your team? Is? Oh, they trash. Right. Mm-hmm. I'd be looking, but that's me. I'm just a realist. Like, hey, what y'all gonna do this year? Nothing. I think, I think, I think from a general, general aspect, though, like, if we, all right, if we just, besides the, the curse being broken, I'm, thinking, I'm just thinking, speaking as from a person that don't even watch baseball. Yeah. It's just like, yo, for for that to come to your city, as far as you see schools closing down, like, yo, I, Ridiculous. we begged for this when I was in school, like, yo, please. We know that's what comes with this, man. The that's whole, not a regular thing. That's whole, a regular thing, right? Yes, yeah, what I'm saying. That's oh, okay. We, we, we oh, want things like that in the city. What, the school's getting shut down? Yeah. For a championship? Yeah. yeah. Because Bro. of traffic, school Bro. buses and things like that. Yeah. No Listen to me. I, I, I lived in New York during the uh, Yankee championships. They didn't school was them. open. School was open. The fuck? Oh, man. See, you I, know why? I, I, yeah. I know why. It might have been different routes. There's no, no, no schools no, no, in the no. Canyon of Heroes. That's why. I know why. I know why it was different. Because we won so often. They're like, why we got to make this a special occasion? At, like, at, mm, Atlanta, mm. Atlanta, this is a shot. I don't, yeah, really yeah. <laughs> I don't want y'all to think he's trying to justify this. This is definitely a shot. Another banger. I'm just saying, yeah, man. Just, we just get so used to winning it. that. Let's see what you did there. That was good. Well played. Oh my gosh. <laughs> but nah, salute Ashley, to them. Ashley, what up? And hopefully the coach curse is lifted, man. We'll time. see. We'll see what UGA do, man. Right. I ain't gonna lie. They because they're on the path to actually oh, get yeah, they one. They in the driver's seat. So if they flop somehow, oh, and I'm not God, wishing it on them. Know. If they somehow, I mean, they got a tough schedule. It's not like they just. I think be all right. yeah. Let me tell you something about Atlanta sports, though. What's so funny? Because my my cousin was out there. He was telling me he was like, "Yo, 
you can tell that the city got PTSD because even when it was up 7-0, no, nobody was waiting. Nobody they was waiting. wilded out. They, they was, was like, listen, yo, listen. Let that, yo, we got to get that yet. last out. And we going to wild out. Right. 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 Don't say nothing. Adam, what up? So don't everybody, you say shit. Ain't nobody being naive to the fact yet, but like they're still on their toes, if you ask me. At least they learn. Yeah, yeah man. Salute to Atlanta. You know what I mean? So I was telling somebody. Who was I on the phone with? I forget who I was talking to, and I was like, nah, this game six is going to be it. And they're like, yo, how you know? I was like, yo, I could tell. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? You when, feel it yeah. in the air. Yeah, yeah, yeah you I could just tell. knew they weren't going to do it at the house, but it's cool. It was, the, the energy was still there, like, right. yeah, I real could deal. Tell. I didn't think they were going to blank them seven, nothing. Like, that was impressive. But, um, you know. Let me tell you how crazy that. I'm just going to give you just an analysis. I stayed eight minutes from the stadium. It took me 45 minutes to get home. That, mm. that, that's how it's supposed to be when you win shit. You know so, what I mean? Yo, that should have worked. Yo. He <laughs> just left the car home and walked to the stadium. Bro, I wanted to lead the whip. Like, <laughs> Yeah, I'll be back. I'll be back. <laughs> so how much overnight parking here? Yes, yeah, keep it. Factory. <laughs> I mean, I already paid for it. Yeah, like, I'll be back. Listen. It's ridiculous. I'm not, I'm not doing this. Wait, you that close to the stadium? Yeah. That's what's up. Okay. I heard the fireworks and everything, man. That's what's up. I knew what time it was. This is bracking. Yeah, yeah. Talk to me. Got to plan ahead. We done with the Braves? You done with your slander? Nah, I, I told you what up. I, 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 I fucks with the Braves. Well, right. for this series. Uh, okay. And we back to norm, normally scheduled program with the Braves after this, though. All right. Um, <laughs> See what I'm talking about? Rock and Roll Hall of Fame? All right, cool. We go there. Let's go. LL, we're starting yeah, Queens. Sure you know. Yeah. You better. Congratulations to LL Cool J and also to um, Mr. One and Only uh, Sean Hove Cow- uh, Carter yeah, on other being borough. in indu- the other borough. <laughs> This guy That's for wild. being inducted into the Rock and Roll <laughs> Hall of Fame. Um, how do y'all feel about that? Do y'all still feel? Well, I shouldn't say still. Yeah, I kind of, I kind of look at that and think to myself, like, what took L. Cool J so long to get in? Like, I, I get Sean uh, Jay was still going crazy. You know what I mean? Like, yeah. so I get, man, we want to wait till he kind of eases up a little bit. Has he eased up? No, but <laughs> I, I said a little bit. I mean, he stopped putting out. Well. He's, nah, not really. But he ain't. He, but like, LA ain't really put out an album like that that in, in quite some time. Right. Cause the last L L record like was like what? Like Hits, bro. <sighs> no, nah, don't do that. I'm, I'm, all nah, right, help me out. That. I'm sure he done some crossover stuff. I got. Yeah, I'm talking about just like for His really pushing album? for him really pushing the album. That's what I mean. I don't mean like he ain't never done nothing else since then. Uh, well, nah, I we think, know he stayed busy in the acting. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I he, think he I'm watching busy. two shows where, where he's like one of the co-stars. Yeah, oh, one in the 2013 called Authentic. 2013. Yeah. Eight years ago. Yeah. I feel like he's done something since then. And the fact that the DJ album. is like, I don't know what was off that album. He might have. <laughs> <laughs> you know, just the fact that he's saying that is validating my point. I mean, when you got so many classics like L.O., you don't yeah, have to. You know what no, I'm saying? I don't have to. That, but that's what I said. Like, I don't understand why we hadn't already done this. But nah, <laughs> salute to him, man. That's, that's a no-brainer. Like, he seems like a first ballot. Hall Rock of Fame yeah. type of guy. Yeah, like he's overdue. Me. I will I will agree with that. Yeah, he is overdue. And that's what I mean. Like, not that he don't fuck. He's. He needed to do more. I'm like he, he had plenty. But once again, this is that's a, my original question was: This is the mm-hmm. Rock and Roll Hall of Fame. How much solace and energy are you really putting behind it? Because it's still the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame. It's a big deal because they put they put other musicians other than rock and roll in it, which is actually odd to me as well. Plus, we invented all all ill music, but that's a whole other topic. Which <laughs> brings me right back to my point. Like I I just like it's a big deal, I guess. But I kind of put it on the same level of when time gives you the top fifty rappers of all time. Time magazine. Exactly. That's how I feel. That's how, that's what I'm saying. Or when um, GQ does something else under the same type of thing. It's like, yo, who who wrote this article? Who did you really consult to come up with this? Right. That's what I'm saying. That's kind of it's sad. I look at the rock. It's not even sad. It's just accurate of how I look at it. You know what I mean? Yeah. The Rock and Roll Hall of Fame is in Cleveland, Ohio. Come on. What else is in Cleveland? Dave Chappelle. <laughs> Odd place to like choose to live. Like right. That you're not from, but you go there. You yeah. live at Dave, Ohio. Why? Wow. <laughs> Forgive me if I'm wrong for, for the audience, for people that may not understand what 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 qualifies Jay Z to be in the rock and roll Hall of Fame. What qualifies LL to be in the rock and roll Hall of Fame? They just do all, there's all genres of music in there. That's yeah, what it makes is. it That's so crazy. All right. That's what all makes right. it kind of crazy that it's called the rock and roll Hall of Fame. I right. got where they were going. Yeah. But, you know, all, all music is connected and we started Absolutely. all of it. So, yeah. You know, at least all the flash shit. They should have, you know, they should have had bring um, Jay out. Barack Obama? That would have been a good choice. Oh, they did that. I'm sorry. Uh, <laughs> oh, did Barack bring him out? Yeah. Barack. I guess Dave, Dave, Yeah. Yeah, it was pretty. Really? Uh, yeah, it was pretty. Uh, I just saw Jay's. Um, it's pretty fucking epic. Jay's I ain't gonna thing, lie. So. Yeah. yeah, but but Jay had a <laughs> Jay had a speech and that kind of made news more than him actually getting inducted in there. Yeah. And the most surprising part of the speech is when he kind of gave. Well, he kind of gave. He gave credit to Dane Dash and said, "Hey, basically, like I, even though we don't kind of see, we don't see eye to eye, mm-hmm. I couldn't have done all of this without you." 
which I thought was uh that was a big step because acknowledging it publicly yeah, because they don't fuck with each other for quite some time now. Well, I mean, you know, humility is a, is a great way. It's a great change. It's a great way for people oh, yeah, to look man. at you and be even more revered. It shows growth. It's, it's you know what I mean. It Absolutely. shows like I'm trying to. What's Jeezy and and on Gucci's favorite word? Extend the olive branch. I shot your man. And, no, oh, right. That's not. That's on my fault. Yo, I thought you were going somewhere else. I'm sorry. Go ahead. Yo, <laughs> <laughs> this guy. My, my bad. Calm down, nah. Shit. <laughs> this dude stay shooting today. Um, but yeah, no, just trying to, you know, not trying, but you know, just saying like, hey. You were a big part of his career. And just saying that, like you said, mm -hmm. on that stage, him saying it is one thing, but on that stage is what I was really surprised about because I did hear that part of the clip as well. So That's dope. And um, after that part of the clip, you know, Dan came to and said, hey, I want basically, I'm going to paraphrase what he says, basically like he extended the olive branch or I want to extend it back. And like, I don't want to like beef like this no more. Like I want to kill all of that. I'm going to need to know what he said for real. You want me to read quote? Yes. When, when people like Damon talking, you want to hear it. Worth Are you word. sure? <laughs> yeah. So he, well, first he said, Tyler I, Prime, what up? I ain't got no fucking boss because I am a boss. <laughs> Yo, is that what he said? No, he, he didn't say that. <laughs> All right. He definitely didn't I'm say that. I'm about to say, it's like the breakfast club rent. <laughs> I'm a boss. My Yo, son has uh, cooked. No, get it. Right. I'm sorry. <laughs> but I, I have no beef with him. No beef he had. Uh, let's get lawyers out of it and then let's talk. I'm, I, I definitely appreciate the acknowledgement. Uh, I would never want to think that we have to go to court to resolve anything he added we can talk about it the culture needs us two strong black men working out a problem mm. even if they work together they can do it go separate ways and they can be still be cool so i i like i, I like that energy you know i'm i'm, I'm on like that, that big time like i like that like man up and like yo we, we ain't we ain't, i ain't saying we're gonna be best buddies out of this shit but mm. like we ain't, we ain't enemies like we ain't that right you know what I mean? So salute, salute to both of them, and I hope this, I hope that actually comes to fruition, man. Yes, mm -hmm. indeed. Yeah, you know exactly. I mean? Ten at the same time. Appreciate that, Tyler. But, um, so, but you know, just let's revisit why they beefing. The most recent reason, anyway, the rights to uh, reasonable yeah. doubt. Reasonable doubt. Uh, well, NFT. for well for Dane to be able to sell, mm -hmm. um, reasonable doubt as an NFT. Right. What do you think that would take? What it would take? Yeah, that's probably gonna have to get off the table. If I had to guess. Okay, so. Let, let's I'm, I'm guessing because we don't know. Go ahead. I, I'm, I'm guessing that would have to come off the table. I'm just saying. What if Jay said, I will give you okay. Blueprint 2.1, Kingdom Come, and. No, nah, I can't use the Black Album. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> giving him the bottom of the barrel. <laughs> giving him the bottom of the Jay-Z I'm barrel. just saying. No, I get it. That's still valuable. Those three, four, and, and Jay gets to keep reasonable doubt. You think Dane would take that? It's fair. That's fair? So my just uh, financially, so I don't think there's gonna be much difference in it. But I think that significance to what Jay Z would want, mm. I feel like reasonable doubt would be the more important one to him. Court? And I think I, I got I gotta believe for Dame here, it's not a big like nostalgia play for him. It's about the money. Yeah, it's about yeah. yeah. So I would well, think, you, no, you can't so, say that. No, no, let me not say that. You're right. But I would say I would think he would have less in my mind, <laughs> less nostalgic like I think I, I think Dame kind of <laughs> apply more pressure it was kind of like yo if that's what it is then let's 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 really handle this like men yeah. like i think he took it as an opportunity to really see where jay heart was at, you know what i'm saying yeah but i think but, if jay's heart wasn't in well we speaking obviously and because we don't know these motherfuckers but i'm just saying like i don't think i'm saying that shit if i didn't have or or desire to even talk open that wound up and even talk about it or have dialogue or speak on it i think the way jay handled the whole rockefeller um the selling of that, mm -hmm. you know, well, I feel like I feel like that he should allow Dame to have the upper hand in this deal. Okay, that's but you know, I feel but I feel the need. Well, to, see, you making it need, sound like he ain't getting nothing out of it. Yo. He did get something out of it. Got a lot. He, he didn't get the upper hand. Oh my gosh. He, I think, I mean, we can, we my can we play my game now? Can we play my game now? So what? What would e what other three Jay Z albums would equal Reasonable Doubt? Because JP said, "What kind of a horrible monopoly trade is this?" <laughs> And I thought I was you doing pretty two good. Utilities and BO Railroad for Baltimore <laughs> Park Place. Yo, as long as you continue to pass, go. Yeah. So that's what I'm saying. Where? Where got hotels? Where did, it, <laughs> on the railroad. <laughs> um, nah, bro. I, I think I think that that reason board has too has too much nostalgic like worth to him to like to because it'll be hard for him to say how. Now you gave up the ones I think if he was gonna give one up, those would be the ones. Maybe Blueprint Three too. Maybe throw that one in there. All right. 
So Blueprint Three, Kingdom Magna, Come. Can have Magna Carta. Give him that one too. Give him Magna Carta too. Now, now, now it's now. That's too much now. Yeah. Now so you how how many albums would you willing to be given? I was trying to come up with three, three? to three? equal one. All right. So you, you, Kingdom Come. Yeah. I say Kingdom Come. Mm -hmm. I would say. We about to rank Jay -Z volume album? volume two. No hell no, he's not getting volume two. <laughs> He's not going with that. Man. All right, so I'll go volume. Back to what I said. I'll go volume three. I'll do uh, Kingdom Come. I can't even give it. And God, watch it, watch it go. I got to think of one. I got to go I'm Blueprint 2. I'm volume point. one. You give him volume one, too. I give him volume one. All for reasonable doubt. That's not bad. All right. Deal. <laughs> Dame. You're welcome. Me. <laughs> You're welcome. You're huh? <laughs> welcome. You ain't no boss if you can't make that trade. How about that? You just made that happen. <laughs> what, what else? What else? What other beats you got to solve? Yeah. What other beats? Oh, Jay Z's on uh, Instagram. Okay, Jay Z's off Instagram. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Fucking grand I opening. Y'all yeah, feel like they, they they are they that they'll that their main issue is their personal relationship or business relationship. Uh, I think it's both. Oh, it was, I, it was yeah. definitely business. It was definitely business. I, I think it's both. But I think the business was tied to the personal. Yeah. So yeah. I think that I think growth happened. I think a lot, a lot of growth happened, and it got big. Them cats got rich really, really young and really, really quick. Yeah. Like and so like, and we start growing, and I don't mean you less of a friend. Well, I know we've had this conversation a bunch of times, but like, we we grow in different directions, and the shit that you might think is ill, <clears throat> I'm looking at you like, yeah, nah, that's not ill to me anymore. Right. <laughs> like I, I kind of see myself going on a different like plane or different you, paradigm. You, yeah, you might want to go this direction, and I'm like, yeah, I don't really want to go that way anymore. Let's drop some. Uh... SAT words. They're 44% of 444. Four, four. <laughs> Yo. <laughs> that's got to be JP. I ain't even got to look. I ain't even got to look. <laughs> um, yeah, are, we done, right. are we done with Jay for a minute? Oh, yeah. All right. Um, oh, man. Because you mentioned him getting on Instagram for a minute. Yeah, he was on and then and he was off. Yeah, he saw them DMs. I was like, yeah, I'm not yeah, doing this. He said, uh, yeah. Yo, how, how many DMs do you think he had in that, in that short, like, 24 oh, hours? Gosh. Picture? He's probably still, they probably still sending DMs million. to a closed account. But, nah, you know why I think he did it, though? This mm -hmm. is my thing. Just well, he did it to promote the movie he had coming out on Netflix. Which Why are you was... taking the fun out of my... Oh, good. God damn. Dang. Sorry, sir. I be trying to... Listen. Hey, Joe, delete that last part. Quicker than that. <laughs> Edit that out. <laughs> what else we got on the list? Edit I ain't that out. Yeah, we done. All right. Did we you watch the movie? We done. Not yet. I uh, mean, either. No, yeah, you know. I, I actually want to catch it, though. I'm, yeah. like, I'm a big fan of it. I saw the preview, and Idris is in it, and then you know, my homegirl is in it. What's her name? Um, There's several You people. niggas gay. What the fuck? She's in it. Would you know? Oh, I'm going to say. She did the Boondocks voices. I didn't know. Y'all don't watch the Boondocks? All right, forget it. I didn't know where that was going as Thank it you. pertained to the. Thank to, you, Joe. I didn't know if it was a line from the movie. You don't know Joey respect. Yeah. Oh, shit. All right, my father, I take it back. Somebody get button on the phone. You talking, about, you, you talking about Regina King? Yeah. Thank you. You might not want to do that. Yeah. Do that. Thank you. Yeah. Joe Button, you might not want to do that. That was a joke. I don't even know what the fuck he's doing. I, I don't listen to that. I'm not buying listen. it. At this point, you're doing everything. Oh, yo, chill. I, hey, yo, I'm not buying show. it. This is not. We are not that podcast. We're not gonna do it. We are not that. <laughs> Shout out to Jose. We are Everything. not that podcast at all. Thank you, thank you, JP. Let's talk about that. Wu Tang finale. Will, which? Oh, that's right. Will I'm, I'm has it. Spoil it, good. Can we? It, Court, have you seen it? You have you, Court ain't watching Wu Tang. Nah, nah, I was looking at the comments, but um, <laughs> now nah, I'm not. Well, I'm, I'm not tuned into Wu Tang though. Oh, I'm, I'm, I'm tuning in though. I've been BMF locked in. <laughs> You've been disappointed. I ain't gonna change the subject. Anyway, yeah, no, 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 we get to that in a minute. We can talk about that in a second. Do we have to. Swell, what up? Yeah, because listen, man, you like over three out here. Anyway, <laughs> so the Wu Tang finale. The thing. Let me recap it this way Go. and try to talk in some gener generalities you don't because the last, <laughs> the last, the uh, last half of the second season has really been some exemplary writing and cinematography that's going on. I know y'all like, what the hell I got to do with the Wu? But I'm telling you, it brings their story home more like you've never heard it before. It's listen. The way they take you in the mind of the RZA and what you guys was going through and what Ghostface is going through and you think about the songs and the